the world's oldest tools possibly crafted more than 3.3 million years ago have been discovered in northwest Kenya by a Franco-Kenyan research team. The set of stone flakes and anvils were found in Lomekwi 3 off the shores of Lake Turkana. They are 700,000 years older than any other such stone tools ever found. They predate by 500,000 years the earliest known fossils of the genus Homo. The implications will be far-reaching if evidence holds up, since it's long been believed that toolmaking was a skill exclusive to Homo. This discovery suggests it was the more ancient human ancestors who made the cognitive leap needed for crafting such implements. Indeed, we were surprised that the tools we found are so much older than the older one and also by their uniqueness. The results are being published in the journal Nature. More artifacts are still being uncovered. Our tools show that the Chokana region is one of the richest repositories of the fossil and stone tool evidence of humanity's history. Not, not just of the local Chokana people, but of all living people in the world. Until now, the earliest known stone tools were found at Gona in Ethiopia and were dated to 2.6 million years ago. This latest discovery could indicate Kenya and not Ethiopia is the cradle of mankind. If we're going after what makes us human, not just walking upright or, or having hands like this, but what makes us human, then one of those things is making tools in order to better survive. And if you're using that criterion, then with what we have at Lomekwe, in addition to all the fossils, Samba Torkana and other fossils, then we can start really to say, Kenya is the cradle of humankind. Each year, the prehistoric mission in Kenya organizes excavations involving Kenyan, French, and American researchers its research is supported by the Kenyan government. Mahia Mutua, CCTV.